Hey folks, this video is an attempt to explain why the NASA ISON conspiracy is actually a misunderstanding of the images used over a much shorter than average time frame. I've essentially recreated here a pseudo situation similar to the NASA coverage of ISON. You see the timestamps changing, but did I just put the same image up there over and over again? No, but if you watch this channel, how do you not immediately ponder such a thing? Given the way I and most other people show the sun, it appears the sun is motionless the way you watch it here. You're probably more used to seeing the sun in motion something to the tune of this. It's like our daily news and website content. But I speed 12 to 24 hours up to 10 to 20 seconds. This is 3 hours stretched over 30 seconds. NASA stretched their 3 hours of Ison's perihelion out even longer. Now let me speed this up once for you. Okay, I'll do it more than once. You learn early in your solar watching endeavors the speed needed to perceive surface and coronal events on the sun. Now I've got NASA's official ISON images from Perihelion. These are the final processed images available at the link below this video as of the time of publication. I'll admit, the sun looks fake compared to what I show you every single day. But take what I've just told you just now and watch it again a couple times, sped up and then enhanced. Eyes open, no fear. Be safe everyone. 